Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. In this video I'm going to show you how to compress multi-disc games into one file. Um, it is needed for this particular piece of software because it doesn't have the um, option to save and reload as it does on uh, Windows, certain Windows emulators or Android emulators. So this video is going to show you how to do it. It's mainly going to be for uh, for the PlayStation, the Sony PlayStation application on here. Um, now, before this even starts, you need to make sure you have three BIOS files already installed or placed into the um, the library of this application. Um, you need the US version, you need the European version, and you also need the Japanese version. You need all three or this will not work at all. So, I cannot tell you how to get it, but if you look in my link tree, it will give you a good indication of where you can find these um, uh, BIOS uh, files to enable you to use the PlayStation emulator with OpenEMU. So, having got all the BIOS installed and everything like that, we are going to use a game called Metal Gear Solid, but, uh, sorry, let's say that again, Metal Gear Solid, which is the first ever Metal Gear Solid, absolute classic, I love this game, I play this loads of times during the year. Um, so with OpenEMU you need to use the .cue files, so if I drop the first disc in and then drop the second disc in, uh, as you can see, that it's got the uh, CD cover page of the first Metal Gear Solid, if you can remember what it looked like back then. Um, but, you know, I've got the original copy here, so I know exactly what it looks like, and that is basically it. So to load it, all you need to do is, or well, all you can try and do, should we say, is double click, but you get an error message saying that the required M3U file is missing. And this game requires multiple discs and must be loaded using a M3U file with all two discs. So, this is what I meant before by compressing two discs into one. So, first of all, we just need to delete that. So, command delete. So, that needs to disappear, otherwise, you know, it wouldn't work. Now, I use a piece of software called TextMate, uh, which you can Google, download it, get it up and running. Um, and here you have, as you can see, I've already done it before, but here you have um, the, uh, the the text base of what you need. So what you need to do is go to your file, drop in the cu uh, the dot cue file in there, and then we will drop the second one in there. Now we just need to delete a load of stuff. So delete that. Keep deleting keep deleting now as you can see here even though i dropped in the dot cue file it's saying it's the dot bin file that is the windows version that is needed so we just change that to dot cue all right so take out the uh, speech marks and keep going down right so that is basically it for for disk two and you just need to mimic it for disk one so let's just delete everything boom 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 boom, boom. so again change dot bin to dot cue and that is it that is all you need to do and that is for any other multi-disc games for playstation uh, that also includes Final Fantasy, because I know Final Fantasy 7 is run over three discs, Final Fantasy 9 is run over four discs. Um, you know, just do exactly the same, put them all in one after the other, compress it down just a single line, change it to .cv, and that's it. So, now we need to save it. Uh, so, so, file, save as. So I'm going to save it um, as you need to save it as Metal Gear Solid dot M three U. All right, that is it. That's what you need to change it to. But you you can call it whatever you like, but you must put dot M three U to turn it into that file. 
all right so where the metal gear solid folder that i created because that's where the, the original files came from and then we just simply click save and as you can see here another file was just turned up saying m3u rather than dot uh, rather than a q or a bin file you've now got an m3u file what you've got to do then is just get rid of that drag it in and once again you know it's worked because it's got the metal gear solid cd cover case on there and just double click and that is it you are up and running just let it run for a little bit just to make sure it gets onto the the home page still thinking about it <laughs> and there we go that is how you are able to run multi-disc games on open emu by using textmate uh, just need all you have to do again just to recap is just to compress all the discs down into one single file and open emu will just read it as one single disc so you don't have to bother about closing down the application, saving it, closing it down, reloading it, and then the files just go back. You know, because some games have to go backwards and forwards, backwards and forwards. It can be really annoying. So this is a good bit of kit to uh, for for Mac users where you don't have to bother with that because it's all compressed into into one disk. So if this has helped you, please subscribe. Uh, and obviously, if you are stuck, make a comment. Uh, I will get back to you as soon as I can. And um, I hope to hear from you soon.